hi you guys welcome back to my channel you are here with yes i am her i see pool thank you for being here with me because if you you could have been anywhere in the world but you are here with me little old icy pool thank you so so much <sighs> i want to give a big shout out to all my new subscribers welcome to yes i'm her icy food channel i love you guys you are welcome to like comment subscribe share you are welcome to interact with me join the family and i do want to give a great shout out to my um old subscribers that's here with me that's been rocking with me since day one you guys are the best um i truly ap appreciate you guys um i do want to um put some notifications out there um do not forget that i am doing a hundred dollar cash app giveaway um if you help me get to 1000 subscribers 1k yay help me get to 1k and i am giving out a hundred dollar cash app reward it's true i am giving it out um what else yes so yeah you guys welcome to my channel thank you for being here with me i'm i'm slowly rising i'm rising i'm rising and it's a beautiful thing because you know i enjoy this i enjoy getting in front of the camera and talking to you guys i have to learn how to like not look this way but look that way <laughs> But, you know, work with me, work with me. I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. I don't know. I think I just like looking at myself at the camera. I like looking at myself in the camera to make sure, you know what I'm saying, everything is on point or whatnot. Because when you looking at the lens, you can't tell if everything's on point. So, yeah, my eyes be looking kind of crazy. Camera, when I ain't looking at the camera right. We're going to work on that. But, um... I am super duper excited because I'm still I'm still here. I'm still rocking. I'm still rocking and rolling, you guys. I am still rocking and rolling. Okay. <sighs> so today. Sorry about that, you guys. I am back. So today we're going to do part three of the five topics that needs to be discussed when newly dating. Okay. We need to talk about them five topics because they are important. So right now, um, I'm not going to hold you guys up. You know how we do. We're just going to jump straight in. We're going to jump straight into the topics okay so the first one will be dun, 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 dun. <laughs> no but the first one will be hygiene okay we need to talk about that hygiene baby because if you're not a regular if you don't have a relationship with the water then we got a problem okay I need you to have for me I need you to have a deep relationship with the water like you do with, mm, okay, what could I use for an example? Like you do with trying to talk to a lady, I guess, trying to talk to a lady. But I need you to have a deep relationship with water because it's so important. Your body needs to be hydrated. Okay, your underarms need to be hydrated, your private areas under, you know what I'm saying, your feet need to be hydrated, your breath need to be hydrated, so I need you to have that. I need you to have that communication with, with your water, okay? And man, make sure y'all hit that topic, talk about it. Like, okay, so um, what do you think about hygiene? Ask that person, what do you think about hygiene? And they gonna let you know. And then if they not if they not getting straight to the point like you want them to get straight to the point get straight to the point for them be like so uh how often do you take your showers or how often do you take your baths how often do you brush your teeth do you floss 
do you goggle with peroxide or do you just goggle with water or do you goggle with mouthwash or do you not goggle at all <laughs> for real that is important okay how long do it take you to take your shower or do you take a shower or do you take a bath okay or you know do you wash up in your bath water or do you, you know what I'm saying, just sit in that bath water and relax just for that, you know what I'm saying, that warmth and that relaxation. Get it, get deep, get deep. Do you wash between your toes? Do you clean out your toenails? Okay. Do you wash your feet while you in the shower? Baby, ask some questions. Do you use the same towel that you use for your face, for your body? It's important. How often do you change your toothbrush? Hmm, baby, we could get deep, okay? So I'm gonna leave that right there, y'all. Make sure y'all hit on that hygiene topic, okay? The next one would be eating habits. You wanna know their eating habits because I wanna know, I know I wanna know. I'm gonna ask questions like, um, so, you like junk food or how how are you with like junk food or how are you with like eating your vegetables and stuff like that or do you eat past a certain time or do you you know um hmm. do you whatever whatever the eating habits may be sorry y'all i can't get y'all enough examples but whatever eating habits come to your mind that you may have to ask ask them what eating habits do you have and you know be open to yours as well I mean at, look we keep if you want straight up if you want a person to be straight up with you honest and you know what I'm saying up front keep it 100 okay we being real around here y'all like my Tetris shirt it's my little Tetris shirt oh, I feel like my way up but um, yeah, we being we being honest around here. Be keep that keep it one hundred. How they say keep it one hundred, keep it one hundred. Okay, so well, yeah, ask about those eating habits or whatever. Get into all those um, deep questions, and the next one will be habits, plain habits. Like, what kind of habits do you have? Do you tend to um? Hey, look though, I know somebody that got that I, I'm so glad that that was like long, long, long in the past. They used to just like peel crust off the bottom of their feet. Like, no, that's some nasty ass shit. That's nasty. Why are you peeling the crust off your feet and letting it pile up like it's some snow or something? That's nasty, bro. That's nasty. So, man, ask about habits. You know what I'm saying? Ask, ask, look, huh. Do you, do you like, do, I don't know. I don't even know. It's like, when it comes to habits, it's like, you just got to pay attention to people. You got to pay attention to people because that right there was like a turn off. Like, damn, for real, you got that comfortable with me? Don't get, that's another thing. Don't let, as soon as a person starts trying to get comfortable with you, shake that shit up. Shake it up. Shake it up like you shaking up three bags of chips and mixing them up in one shake them up shake it up but yeah ask about habits what's what habits do they have or um do they have any habits that they want to share with you and then you know you share your habits or whatever so y'all give it's a give and take situation okay it's a give and take it ain't a one-way street don't be trying to make like you all this and that and you're not because nobody is Everybody have their own situations going on, so share it. Sharing is caring. You hear me? I'm sharing this information with y'all, and I know y'all care. Sharing is caring. Okay. The next one will be pet peeves. Inquire about their pet peeves, you know? You might have men that don't like a woman to wear weave. You might have men that don't like a woman to wear makeup. You may have men that don't like a woman to wear eyelashes. 
You might have men that don't like women to show their skin. You may have men that don't like women to be so outspoken and so confident in themselves. You, they, you, they want them to be mute, quiet, and, and, and just a puppet or some shit. <laughs> but, and then, on the other hand, you may have women that don't like men to wear that black spray in the front of their head and make their liner look crispy. And then when they take a shower, the shit look all bit out of shape, you know? You may have women that don't like men to wear, um, what? Skinny jeans. You might not like, you might have women that don't like men to wear their pants low, where it's showing their drawers, because I am one of them. That shit look nasty to me. That's the turn up, make me want to throw up, make me want to just spray your booty with smell fresh. For real. You might have women that don't like men that gossip. I don't like them, Ken. I don't like a gossip man. If you a gossiping man, you suppose you was born a woman. You were supposed to be born a woman, but the DNA had got mixed up somehow and it just messed you all up. You a gossiping man, pray about it, baby. Because that's a curse. It's a curse. Of God. Okay, and you may have women that don't like men to have female friends. You may have women that don't like men to hang out a whole lot. Okay, we can go on and on. But anyway, inquire about those pet peeves, right? Yeah, inquire, inquire about those pet peeves because you want to nip it in the bud. You want to make sure, you know what I'm saying, we putting this out on the table because we don't want no issues, okay? We don't want no issues. Because you cause you causing problems. You causing problems when you hold them back and you keep the secrets. You cause problems. Okay. And then the last but not least, we wanna speak about the zodiac. What do you what's your sign and you know what do you think about zodiac signs and um do you think there are similarities in people or characteristics in people that share the same sign or, you know, anything like that? I'm interested. I want to know when your, when your birthday. I don't want to come straight off like, what's your sign? I don't want to do that. <laughs> <'Cause>, <laughs> I don't want to do that. But I want to know when your birthday. Tell me when your birthday. Okay? Because now I'm finna... I, Basically, I'm not going to basically figure you out, but at the same time, it gives me a better, you know what I'm saying, outlook of you. It gives me a better understanding. That's how I feel personally. You can feel how you want to feel about Zodiac signs, and I'm going to feel how I feel about Zodiac signs. But it, with that being said, I like to know. And then sometimes people be lying. It's about, you be like, yeah, what's your sign? Oh, I'm a, uh, I'm a Taurus. What you know about Taurus? No. The way you just told me your sign, let me see your ID. Let me see your ID. Even if you you for real and you telling the truth, I still want to see your ID. I need to make sure for myself that you're not being fugazi, okay? I want to know. And then I basically just, you know, put that in my, my, um, my little whatever. I keep that with me. You, that's your sign. Now I'm going to, you know, we're going to get to know each other. I'm going to pay attention to your characteristics, you know what I'm saying, your ways or whatnot. I'm, 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 I, am type, I am the type of person that will study you. I will study, not study you in a way to find something bad about you, but just to study you in a way to figure out if you're the one for me. Okay? Just to see if you're the one for me because ain't no sense of sitting up here wasting time playing games. If you ain't the one, God sent, you just a disturbance. Because you got to know, you know, we'll get some people that come in our life to kind of like mess us up and throw us off our square. And you will get some people that come in our life that's coming in our life to actually help build us up. You got the ones that's going to break you down because you're too powerful. Well, I, you can be powerful. Mentally, physically, emotionally, spiritually. You could have a person that and don't like your shine or don't like how confident you are, how strong-minded you are, and they'll come and try to rain on your parade and bring you on down. 
or you are having people that's, that love that about you, that love that spark, that shine, that glow about you, and they want to build you up. They want to help build you up because they want to be a, a unit with you. They want to be a duo, a duality, okay? They want to be some strong power couple, and that's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about power couple. I ain't talking about, you know what I'm saying, douchebag ass couples. Mm -mm. Me no like that. Me no like that. Okay. So I do want to thank you guys for tuning in to my channel to catch up on the five topics that you need to discuss when newly dating. Stay tuned to Friday. That will be the last five that we will be discussing. And then we'll be on to the next video. So with that being said, I do want to thank you guys so much for being here with me and showing me so much love for me, so much to me. I ain't going to cry yet. I ain't going to cry yet. But I promise y'all, I'm seeing it. I'm seeing the growth, even though it's taking its time. And I'm very patient. I'm very patient. I'm very determined to conquer what I came here to conquer. So with that being said, I truly, truly love you guys. I love you guys from the bottom of my heart. Even the ones that maybe don't even like my videos, but just watch them just because they don't have nothing else to do. But I truly appreciate you, boo. Because you could have been anywhere in the world, but you're here with me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. So, with that being said, I am about to go treat myself to some lunch. You know, I'm going to take myself on a date because a lot of times we be so busy with helping other people and taking care of the people where we don't take care of ourselves. So, with, I'm going to go treat myself, relax, you know, listen to me some motivational music and get in the ambiance of being beautiful and I love you guys. I say nothing but love. Positive energy. Positive vibrations to you guys. Take it all in because I'm here to give it. And again, thank you for tuning in. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. Thank you.